Hello everybody, welcome back to Prison Architect Episode 6. I mean, Imperial Prison Episode 6. Yeah, this is an Imperial Prison. How could I honestly forget that? This place is absolutely disgusting as well. Alright, so we have 53 grand in cash, so that's good. Alright, let's build up Death Row a little bit more. And someone, um... Told me that, uh... Actually, in the comment section, that, um... So you don't need that camera there. Or hollow cam. That, uh, prisoners can escape from large pipes. Which is fine, I guess, because they should just come out in the water pump station. So I'm not that worried about that. <laughs> Alright, let's add some uh, flooring to make the walking actually a little bit faster. I'm sure my droids would love doing that. Alright, we have all these cells, so let's just... Alright, that probably seems like a waste of money to something to you, but... It'll speed things up a little bit. Alright, so we'll be up to 48 cells. We don't actually need a shower in death row. I did mark this as death row only, yes. Perfect. So we could dismantle all these shower heads. Oh, look, some monkey death row prisoner gets a big cell. Hopefully we can get a, get a lot of death row prisoners to help with our cash flow problems. We start killing them later. I don't know what these prisoners are freaking out about. Do I not have plumbing to all these? I guess not. Cool, we just got our next, we got our uh, 50 cell grand done, so that works. All right. Guess we can do our long-term investment and a tool cleanup. Probably want uh, Old Sparky to have its own power supply later on. Alright, but currently we need to expand the size of our kitchen as that's currently lacking quite a bit. Our kitchen and this canteen, they are pretty small. So we don't have any death row intakes. Hopefully eventually we will. Alright, electric chair. We should probably get rid of the toilets out of that room. I forgot those were in there. Ah, I need to stop it in Q. I'm 
I'm not sure why this isn't finishing. We shall have to see. Maybe it just needs a door. That appeared to be it. Alright, so let's blow the size of this canteen up in the kitchen. I swear I can never find anything in this list. There we go. Alright, we can start enslaving prisoners to do our bidding in a little bit. Oops. The all-powerful cooker. Alright, electric. And we should be good to go. Maybe we'll put one more sink in. No, it won't fit. We probably need some more seating though, I'm just looking at that. I'd be kind of pissed if I lived in this prison and that was and the seating was that awful. But interestingly enough, I would also never be in prison, so I guess I wouldn't have to worry that much. So our big canteen and kitchen upgrade is done, so that's half our objective just for this episode. And the cooks cannot complain, they don't have enough uh, to work with, material-wise. Oh, let's fix that arms guards deployment as well while we're doing this. Uh, 48 out of 50 prisoners. We're getting a few more in a few minutes. It's a how wide is the, how wide is this? It is walls. It's 13. By 52. So we need to have it 13 by an odd number. Alright. For our next all block. Can't put it there. Thirteen by fifty one. Perfect. This person's getting big in no time. Go little droids, go! What kind of alien is he? Billy shits. That actually sounds really bad to say, but I think that's his name, how you'd pronounce that. Shits? Is that how you pronounce that? Shoplifting? I think he got caught smuggling imperial contraband, like some spice or uh, transporting blasters or something. That's my thoughts on the matter.
Alright. Because our power supply is pretty high. Garbage. I'll take a little trash bin. Yeah, we can use some of them, I guess. We have our serving tables. Our one serving table. Cleaning closets. Is there a minimum size for that? Three by three. Looks like we found a good use for that land. We need janitors when the prisoners can just do it themselves. Give them some real life skills. I feel like we're spending our newfound wealth very quickly as well. Come on, finish the building. What are you guys doing? Lazy people. Yeah, that yard will have to change too. Yeah, prison labor. A lot of people will be able to work to uh, clean floors while they're in there. Alright, you gotta finish the uh, cell block building, though, droids. I'm not totally sure what you're doing. Yay, they finally finished. We have a lot more room for fitting rebels in here now. So then I was uh, reading a Game Informer magazine today and it had some uh, interesting details about uh, Star Wars Battlefront actually. It was talking about uh, game modes, like one was called Walker or Walker Takedown or something. Still looks pretty interesting. Not, I'm still not sure about the game. If it's going to be a uh, ripoff of uh, Battlefield with Star Wars skin on it or what. Well, I guess we'll figure that out eventually. Like, when the game releases. Oh, don't the prisoners look so happy sleeping in their cell? Alright, we also need to get a good prison laundry system up and running. Because they're probably pretty upset about that. We need some uh, more R2 droids. It's very apparent. We have a massive infrastructure program going on right now. And we're making 2800 bucks a day, so nothing wrong with that. We're just spending crap tons of money. Hopefully we finish a few more grants though and we'll be well on our way. 
And we'll have a pretty big population by then. I probably could actually increase our uh, intake if I wanted to. Why is he even in solitary? He's like, let me out. I'm not sure why he's in there. Minimum security do not need life punishment. Ten prisoners are up for parole. Wow. I cannot type. Cleaning cupboard. Covered. Covered. Cupboard? It's a cupboard. Prison labor. Twenty jobs. Hey, you guys can actually work now. You guys can clean. Uh, let's make the uh, armory staff only, though. Just uh, throwing that out there. Staff only. I guess they can go in the offices. I don't see why not. Go droids, go. You're the backbone of this prison. Are the prisoners act, oh no, they are cleaning. See, spiffing the place up. And I overwhelmed my workmen, or my R2 droids. Alright, so where should we build the laundry? Actually, we need to uh, figure out the powering of this uh, visitation area as well. That's embarrassing. Did they come to visit their relatives in the pitch black? Oh well, that's life in an imperial prison. I mean, what do you expect? Top-notch resources? They couldn't even build the second Death Star on time. They sent Darth Vader to finish it. Darth Vader's not a, a construction expert. He is a Sith Lord. So yeah, we have quite the backup of uh, materials. That yard is disgusting. Shower head. Nope. Wrong category. We're not going to put a four drains in this because it's an imperial prison. Prisoners don't need to be taken well care of. They can live in their filth in this prison. I mean, what's the emperor going to do? Say, I oh, can't do that? He's not going to care. He's, gonna, he's gonna, probably going to want us to build uh, like a massive uh, license plate factory to uh, solve for all the TIE fighters we have to replace because they get shot down left and right. So they all have their uh, own unique uh, vinner, or yeah, their own unique plate, I guess. I don't know. I mean, with spaceships, do we need like a license plate? I have no idea. I probably just added some more trucks to the deep to the list. Oh well, we, we cleared them out, so that's good. Alright guys, so episode 6 we accomplished about half of what I wanted to do. We built a new cell block. 
so that's good. We also got some uh, prison labor underway. And we're up to 58 prisoners now. It's pretty good. We got room for 92, so we'll have a few more after that. All right, guys, if you like episode 6, don't forget to please rate, comment, and subscribe. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.